Do we still feel the same way about Lazuli Label? That's the question of the day. We all know by now, Lazuli Label's launches are very few and far between. And when they do launch things, it's usually very small drops, the same thing, just different colors. And we know other brands that do that, like Alphaly. Until as of lately, they've been pretty good with coming out with newer releases, but they tend to just keep dropping the Amplify in new colors. Well, Lazuli's kind of the same way. We're seeing a lot of this scrunch sculpt lately, are we not? So what are our thoughts here? Do we still love this brand? Are they still up to par with the other brands that we talk about on this channel? Before we get into it, a quick word from today's sponsor. You know that I know that you know how much I love Ebby. Ebby is such a good brand if you're looking for seamless undergarments. Most of the thongs I used to wear had heavy bands on them that would just dig after a long day. I couldn't wait to take them off. Ebby is so different from that. In fact, anytime that I'm going out, Ebby's my grab and go. Whether whether you're looking for a fun, cute pattern, or some basic nudes, or rich color tones, they have you covered. You guys know I love their seamless thongs because they have the no slip grip. These lie so smoothly, they're undetectable underneath your leggings. This is their willow pattern. If you look up close, it's a gorgeous floral design, full back mesh super breathable, lightweight, and adjustable. Check out their new Only Bra. The Only Bra is a seamless bra that produces the same shaping support and lift of an underwire bra. Of course, without the pain of the hard underwire. Ebby's Cyber Monday is going on right now, up to 70% off site-wide. Use my code AshleyGata20 for an extra 20% off. My code can be stacked on top of sale items for an additional discount. Plus, save an extra $25 when you spend $175. This will automatically be applied in your cart. So shop the link in my description box and don't forget to use my code. Let's see what we have here. Wow, these are some summer colors. Okay, but don't get it twisted. They are coming out with darker, more seasonally appropriate colors as well. We have fuchsia pink. Oh my God, they're going ham on the pinks. So this fuchsia pink looks a lot like the raspberry pink actually. Out of any other pinks that they have right now, the raspberry pink is super similar. I'm actually not really a pink person too, so um, eh. Glacier blue, now we're talking. This is a frosty winter blue. Or you could totally wear it in the summer and it's a sky blue. It's all about perspective. And then the last three colors are three variations of the color gray. They love their grays too, man. <laughs> I only have the color dark charcoal gray here today. So I, I apologize if I don't have the other two grays to share with you. This one I do have. And to be honest with you, I don't know if my eyes are deceiving me right now, but I'm definitely seeing some obsidian green in these. What the heck? I think I'm staring in this ring light for too long. I'm going nuts. But I am seeing an undertone of green here. It's a very, 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 very dark greenish gray. What the heck? Yo, I see it too, though. You do? Yeah, okay. I see it too. Are you wearing the matching sports bra? I sure as heck am. Yeah, I see it in the sports bra too. Yes. I actually have a love-hate relationship with these leggings. The reason being, this Th this parachute booty? You can see these two pouches, right? These kangaroo pouches right on the bum. They're built for bigger glutes. Girl, if you're considering buying this, you best have the glutes to fill out this patch. My glutes, this close to not filling them out. Almost, they almost don't quite fill them out completely. Once in a while, I'll see a little extra material right above the glutes and I'm like, I guess I gotta go heavier on my hip thrusts to fully fill these out. But for those who can really fill these out, they will work wonders for you. These are designed in such a unique way to make your glutes stand out as much as humanly possible. In fact, I've never seen a legging go to this extent. So you have a moderately compressive waistband. It's not crazy intense like Alpha Lead Amplify, we all know that. But then, right here at the glute pouch, there's no support. It's got a life of its own, all right? It projects this rib paneling going down the sides of the legs and specifically right around the under glute is highly compressive. So highly compressive that you will struggle a bit to get them on. So if you get it up where it needs to be, in other words, this ribbing needs to sit directly underneath your glutes. If it's even a little bit below, you'll get a little under glute pouch right here and you're gonna be like, what the heck is this? This looks ridiculous. Snuggle this rib right up against your glutes and it'll literally compress your under glutes so much that your actual glute 
will look bigger. It'll pop it out that much more. And let's not forget, the scrunch did not go anywhere. So on top of everything, everything, working for you in the glue area, they added in a scrunch on top of it. Just a right in between the cheeks. There's all definition here, okay? Now you do have some ribbing down at the ankle as well. This doesn't really feel as much. It's the one right below the glutes that you can really feel. My size small is okay. If I were to size up, forget it. I'd have way too much material back there and then it'll look ridiculous. But if I sized down, I wouldn't be able to get this past my thighs. That ribbing would be way too tight that I wouldn't even be able to get them on. Stick with your true size. If you're in between, you gotta go based off of what I pretty much just said. How big are your thighs? How big are your glutes? How deep is your love? That's gonna determine which way you go if you're in between. If sheerness is an issue, and that's your biggest concern, grab the darker charcoal colors. They're very, very high-waisted on me. I do notice that out of any legging I've ever owned, these are the only ones that I can roll down a little bit and they look okay. Sometimes I try rolling down leggings and they just look ridiculous. They'll snap right back up on me. They're like, what were you trying to do? You can't be trendy. These, yeah, I can roll them down a little bit and they're pretty great. I would like to say that there's a lot of stretch in these leggings but there's not. Not where there's heavy ribbing. You'll get like no stretch in them. However, when working out in the gym, it does work for me. It's stretchy where it needs to be, like right over the kneecaps, for example. It's not like it's restricting my movements. Out of the leggings and the shorts, I think I prefer the leggings a little bit more. These biker shorts, you know I'm a fan of bikers, but these come awfully long. They need to sit right above your kneecap. If they didn't, if these were any shorter, this compression would literally make your thighs just sausage. So I do think they put a lot of thought and effort into this legging and these shorts. I think that's why they're going so ham on getting it out there. I think they're really trying to push this legging because I think they're trying to make a statement out in the activewear world with this style. Because I don't know about you, but I've heard Personally, have never tried leggings like this before. You know how we tend to review a lot of the same type of legging from all these brands? This is not like any other any other legging I've ever tried, ever. I still have yet to see another one like this. If you have, let me know. I'd like to know which brand it is. So that's just my best guess on why they've been going really ham on coming out with more and more colors in this collection. I think this is their standout piece. This is what makes them unique because no other brand's done it. Up next, we do have some navigation. I actually have a couple leggings I haven't tried from them. They're popping off lately. I saw that new seamless they came out with, so I want to try it for myself. Thank you guys so much for being here. I love you and I will catch you in my next video.